made our way to Salisbury, Indiana on State Road 43, which if anybody ever thinks that Indiana is flat country, you're crazy. <laughs> Winding hills and uh, valleys and really pretty, real pretty drive. And we were told that there's this place called the Yoho General Store, which is right behind us, is a really super cool place to go and they have really good food so we're gonna go find out and then we're gonna leave here and go to some big huge 300 foot off the ground train trestle that I hear is pretty cool but first general store and some food so here we go is that for a big old sandwich big old tenderloin big old cheeseburger so they said the food at the yoho general store was good and it started out good so we're gonna mouth this down and we'll let you know how it goes look good yeah. I don't know if you can see it Right on the tree line, at the top of the tree line, is a train trestle. That thing is enormous. And we're going to go look at it. I was just impressed at how it looked from here. We are just on the outskirts of Salisbury, Indiana, in southern Indiana. And we are here to go look at that train trestle. So here we go. That's kind of cool. Green County. The glare is probably outstanding. I apologize. Wow. What's over here? We just had lunch there. That's what it looked like on the inside. And that right there where them two guys are is where my wife and I sat. So here's where we are. We are here. Sculpture trail. We may have to go check that dude out too. All right, so we're here to see the train trestle. And from what I understand, they still use it. Could you imagine taking a train over that thing? And it goes further than we can see because we saw it when I drove in. It is so hard to describe the magnitude of this thing it is just absolutely enormous and it is silent out here we're out in the middle of nowhere again outside of Salisbury Indiana southern Indiana today's yes today is July 31st I think I see a road over there we're going to go down there.
check this out. A little free library. Take a book, return a book. Well, that's pretty cool. Check it out. Well, that's outstanding. And then it keeps track of how many people opened it. I dig it. That's cool. So there's the trestle. We thought that was super neat. Um, we did sign in. I'm kind of curious when this thing was built. I'm sure one of these things says so. I just did not read it. Terrain clearing began the summer of 1905 and concrete pier completed in 1906. Steel erection began Saturday, September 8th, 1906 from the west and worked its way to the east until completed in 1906. So this thing is what, 111 years old? That's phenomenal. And to think in that year, 1906, they didn't have the equipment that they have now. I mean, that thing was built on the backs of men just trying to progress the U.S. back in those days. That's phenomenal. And I'm certain that, I mean, they just climbed up there. And golly, that's just phenomenal to me. Especially knowing the equipment that wasn't available 110 years ago. Well, that is the Tulip Trestle. Again, like I've said before, it's in Salisbury, Indiana, Southern Indiana. Super sweet out here. Just quiet and calm. We're probably six or eight miles from a town. So it's just silent. And they've... The community has made a, a nice picnic area and uh, observation area. And they've spent time making this worth coming to see. And they actually have some little porta johns if you did decide to come here and spend some time and have a picnic with the family. But that's cool. If you're a trained person, that's probably pretty phenomenal. I'm not, but I still think it's super cool just based on the construction and what it would have taken to build that thing. Very cool. Well, I guess we'll just conclude this one with the Midwest Outdoor Adventure saying, the only way to see something cool like this is to get out. So we encourage you to get out. All it took for us is a little bit of a car drive and you drive right to it and you can drive right under it. So even on a hot day, turn on your air conditioner and come to Salisbury, Indiana and check out this train trestle because it is phenomenal. Pack a picnic, spend the afternoon here and just get away from all the noise and the hustle and bustle of work and city life because it's gorgeous out here. So from us to you, thanks for watching.